So over the last 24 hours, Ada made a very important move. And what it's leading to is a very significant moment in the charts that I want to share with you guys. This is something you guys really, truly need to be aware of because this could change the overall direction of price as we know it. That sounds a lot worse than it is. But so what we saw was eight over the last 24 hours, it came back down. It retested this 30 cent support line. Okay, this is this blue line on the chart here. It's an area that Ada has struggled with when it's below it and it's held when it's above it. Okay, this is this is something that you guys need to know. Now, this is great because we bounced off it, which means that Ada is still holding its, its somewhat bullish momentum. Now, here's the thing. The reason that this is significant is this now brings us to the convergence of two very important trend lines. We have this descending triangle that we've had playing out basically since mid-July, all right? And we also have this ascending channel that we've had playing out, I believe, since, what is that, start of June? Yeah, early June. So they are now coming to a point. ADA needs to make a decision essentially by August 4th. So we're only two days away from this very significant moment for ADA. Now, what's happening on August 4th? The jobs report. <laughs> you can't make this stuff up, guys. <laughs> Sometimes it's funny how these, these market structures play out here. Now, if we get a, a good jobs report, I, I think, guys, we're probably going to trade sideways right into this. We're probably going to feed right into the end of this, this channel here, or right into the end of this convergence. And then ADA is going to make its decision. We're either going to come back down and try to retest this uh, this 30 cent support line again. If we miss it, we might go down to about 28 cents. If we go to the positive side, which if the market currently holds what it's doing, if BTC continues to move to the upside right now, it's at about 29.5. We may go back up and try to retest essentially the top of this level that we saw here. We may go up to about that 36 cent level. As always, guys, this is not financial advice. We don't know what's going to happen, but this is a significant moment. This is something that you need to pay attention to you know, this is this is kind of that make or break moment for probably the next probably the next few weeks in terms of ADA. So I thought I'd share that with you guys. Now, if you guys haven't checked them out yet already, make sure you guys do so. Check out the channel sponsor. Grape. Again, they're building their own layer one chain. If you guys are interested in even just diving in and checking it out, you can use my referral link here. It'll bring you to this sign up page. So all you need to do is just fill this out, sign up, it'll bring you to your page here. You can dig around. There's no obligation. You're not committed to, you know, getting into the pre-sale or anything like that. If you guys like what you see, if you guys like the information that's there, you guys can get into the pre-sale. Again, right now it is still live at $46 a coin while the coin itself is in fact live at about 140 bucks. So obviously there's a pretty pretty significant gap there. Now keep in mind, if you guys get into the pre-sale, you actually can get up to an additional 70% in bonuses. Actually, it's technically even more than that because when you get into the presale via my referral link right here, which I'll have below in the description for you guys too, again, you get that 10% bonus on top of everything you contribute. You get the 60% GGT bonus on top uh, or the 60% GGT bonus, which is the governance token for the chain. And then also during those 120 days while your, your coins are staked, because again, they're going to ask that you don't sell for 120 days. Cause I, you know, everybody would love to buy at 46 and sell at 140 right away. You also get a 20% APY on everything you have in, in that, you know, staked period. So something significant there. I think it's worth at least checking out and diving into doing your research as always. This is not financial advice, but I'm excited guys. I'm liking where this year is headed. I'm liking the direction that we're seeing in the overall crypto market. Uh, I'm enjoying the fact that there may be some sort of clarity coming our way. Hopefully the SEC just gets out of the way and lets us kind of do our thing, but we'll obviously see what happens. Uh, appreciate you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Show your support below, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.